Hi, I'm Pablo. And I'm Sam. And we're Mattress Makers. And in this episode of Mattressology, we're gonna show you how to find the right pillow. Today, we're filming at our fill station pillow kiosk. This is where we customize your perfect pillow. So whether you like a thicker thin, a softer firm pillow, this is where we customize it to fit your perfect needs. Now the pillow is one of the hardest purchases to make because there's so many variables when finding the right support for your head. It's also one of the most overlooked and uh, purchases when people are looking. The first test is the comfort test. Know whether you like a firmer pillow or a softer one. Now this sounds pretty basic and it is, but it's important to know this because even though it's merely a personal preference, this is the starting point. Do you prefer when your head sinks into the pillow or do you like it when your head rests on top of the pillow? Other factors can be if you like to mold and scrunch up your pillow in different positions, or do you like it pretty stiff where like nice and firm? Knowing this information beforehand will help save your time and effort when shopping for your pillow. Now the second test is the thickness test or the alignment. This is a step that one that really determines whether the pillow is right for you long term. The main goal here is to make sure the pillow is keeping your neck and spine in alignment. It's important to note the type of sleeper you are. So your side sleeper, back sleeper, stomach sleeper. Those are all gonna determine the thickness that might be right for you. And if you are a back sleeper, you want the head to be elevated slightly, but you don't wanna to go too much otherwise, otherwise you can restrict your breathing as well as cause strain on the neck, which can lead to waking up with a headache or a stiff neck in the morning. So a thinner to medium pillow generally is where back sleepers like to be. Now if you're a side sleeper, you wanna bridge the gap between your head and the mattress. So if a pillow is too thin, the weight of your head will hang lower than your neck and cause strain, leading to wake up with a neck pain. So generally, most people in the, in the side sleeping position, they like the medium to a thicker pillow that's uh, most comfortable for them. One important factor to take into consideration when searching for a perfect pillow is the firmness of the mattress. So if you're a side sleeper and sleep on a firm mattress, then your shoulders won't sink in as much, which may require you to sleep on a thicker pillow to help bridge that gap. However, a softer mattress will cause your shoulders to sink in more, in which this case, a thinner pillow may be a better option for you. At the end of the day, the best way to figure out if a pillow is right for you is by trying it out for at least 15 minutes on a mattress that is similar to the firmest level of your current mattress. Testing out in this way will allow your body to give you immediate feedback on any adjustments that may need to be made to the pillow. So those are the two things to consider when choosing the right pillow. And if you still haven't found that perfect pillow, come by one of our stores and we'll make a custom pillow for you. In fact, if you come into one of our stores and mention this video, we'll give you 50% off your custom made pillow. I hope you guys enjoy this video. And if you have any feedback, please leave them in the comments below. And also don't forget to like and subscribe to our, to our channel. And if you'd like to learn more about mattress shopping, head over to our website, mattressmakers.com and download our free mattress shopping guide there. Or just click the link below. I'm Sam. I'm Pablo. And we're mattress makers. Sleep well. So, so those are the two things to consider when searching for your perfect pillow. But if you still have not found your perfect pillow, come by our showroom, we'll get you fitted, and we'll match you perfectly for your pillow. Freaking perfect, man. <laughs> you love that word, don't you? It's so perfect. It's so perfect, man.